Yeah, get out of here. Get the fuck out. Thanks for popping in. But you don't want to spoil yourself. Get the fuck out of here. So. Any idea? Any more information you can give me on the missing arcs? No. And that is the distressing part. The Asari, Turian, and Salarian arcs are completely unaccounted for. If they had the same problems with the Scourge that we did, I fear the worst. Should you find any clues, please investigate. Without the other arcs, the promise of the initiative can never be fulfilled. There are no Quarians in this? Tally was my favorite. Just woke up because I'm a dirty American. Holy, that's an early wake up for a dirty American. Jesus. You get up early, dude. Are there any other arcs we should expect? We had hoped Quarians would be part of the first wave. But before departure in 2185, we got word they had technical problems with their ship. It seems they're also bringing along Drell, Hanar, and other species as well. Managing all of their biological needs caused complications. We won't see them for some time to come. It sounds like the Nexus has had a rough time of it. Publicly, I would say we're more than up for the challenge. Privately, I can tell you... It's been a disaster. The Scourge killed hundreds, many of them our senior leadership. Even the founder of the initiative, Gian Garson, is dead. We know. How did Gian Garson die? With the rest because of the Because of the leadership. Scourge! When the Nexus hit the Scourge, a large wing of stasis pods was destroyed. They were killed instantly. These people traveled 600 years and died before they even woke up. Jean Garson never glimpsed Helios. She never saw her vision realized. You did kind of see it realized. When the arcs got launched, that was the realization that, holy shit, it's all, it's all going, right? I mean, she never seen the outcome. Fair enough, but she would have still had that little moment of pride. Kendris mentioned something about hitting the Scourge. How did it play out? Criminal elements took advantage of the emergency and preyed on people's fears. An uprising followed. We had no choice but to turn to the Krogan to deal with them. They crushed the mutiny and the criminals were banished. Exiles, we call them. I doubt we've heard the last of them. They're led by an outlaw, Sloan Kelly. She used to be one of ours. Oh, shit. Who is this Sloan Kelly? She was head of security on the Nexus. She opposed the uprising at first, but eventually turned traitor and joined them. Misguided sympathy for the plight of the common citizen? Nonsense. They posed a direct threat to our existence. Hey, G Pappy, how you doing, buddy? Where's the Krogan now? We know a bunch of them moved off, off Nexus, but where did they go? There don't seem to be many Krogan around. Good riddance. The Krogan demanded a greater say in political matters. The last place you want them involved. Their muscle, nothing more. Oh my Good god. For fighting I don't and like this game. Lifting heavy objects. When they didn't get what they wanted, they left. Get the fuck out of here with that nonsense, sir. The, he, yeah, of course he's got a stream dislike for the Krogan because he's a Salarian, right? He doesn't know what the Krogan's done while we were all fucking sleeping. Oh man, Salarian bullshit. Why don't you like the Krogan? There's only one Salarian it's I ever liked, and it was more than violent, ignorant species. Long ago, they waged nuclear war on one another. Their planet was decimated. My people tried to uplift them, but the Krogan could never tame their worst instincts. What if they bring their tempers to Andromeda? We'll all be dead. You know what? We'll be fine. We will work something out with them. Yeah, I'm doing really good. Um, I'm going to be streaming for another four-ish hours, something. 
But I'm loving Mass Effect so far. What more can you tell me about the initiative? It represents the greatest migration ever attempted. No one had ventured beyond the Milky Way before. We've all left home in search of freedom, fortune, perhaps a new beginning. We are the bravest souls each species has to offer. I hope the Nexus will serve as the seat of government for us all. I hope you're not on the fucking government, honestly. It looks like a melting pot around here. The Nexus is home to several initiative species. Many came ahead of the Arcs. The hope is that this station will one day serve as the governing body in Andromeda. Though I'm not sure what they were thinking, lumping Krogan into the mix. Get the As fuck out of here with that attitude. I tend to have a low opinion of them. Nothing I've seen here has changed that. So why did you get on board in the first place? Like, why did you want to be the revenue guy? Couldn't you have been the revenue guy back home? Why do you think most people came? There are thousands of reasons. One for every colonist here. What does any pilgrim seek? Usually, happiness. Finding the thing that eludes them, the thing to fulfill them. While we cannot promise they will find it, we can facilitate the search. I'm asking about you. Personally, I want to get to know you on a personal level, dude. What do you know about the early days of the initiative? As most everyone knows, Jean Garson's vision made it happen. She was an entrepreneur on Earth. Wealthy. Young for a human. Garson had the idea for the initiative in the early 2170s, I believe. Many thought leaving the Milky Way was impossible. But she persevered. And as with most great ideas, the doubters were wrong. Okay. What do I need to consider in making a planet viable? Assuming the planet supports life, an outpost is critical. People like a roof over their heads and you'll want to eliminate any hostile threats. Whether that's the cat or other terrors lurking in Helios, colonists being murdered on site can be discouraging. Also, scouting and mapping terrain is a priority for any Pathfinder. And don't forget forward stations. You'll want those. Oh shit, wait, do we have to actually set up outposts for real? And then we have some sort of base management mechanics going on that'll be awesome if that's the case um what can you tell me about forward stations i was afraid you'd ask it's mostly what the engineers tell me a forward station allows mining equipment repairs and resupply for field teams i mean who wouldn't want that but take it easy snowing every colonization effort has failed thanks for stopping it's just theory at the moment you get to test it out rider well, I'm glad I get to test it out, you little fuck. That's all. Thanks for your time. Of course. As you pointed out, we need each other. Our futures depend on each other's success. Well, I was kind of coming around to the fact that you were not a complete arsehole and you was kind of lumbered with it, so you're, you're just trying to get to grips. But then you started all the, the Krogan hate speech bullshit. You couldn't leave that behind you. Come on. It's a fresh start. You get to build it. Whoa, shit, dude. All personnel Are you okay? Do you want me to fix it? Hey, you okay? I'm fine. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff yeah. exploding Your hair's like this sticking up. often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening. But not lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. That maybe I was just being paranoid. I've never heard of it, dude. Never heard of it. Um. Are you sure it's paranoia? You know what they say. It's not paranoia. If someone is out to get to you, yeah third time this week. It's getting worse. First one was small stuff. This one could have hurt bad if I'd been closer. That's not good. Sorry, understatement. Yeah. And now I have more repairs. Whoever's doing this has to be stopped before someone gets seriously hurt. That's what I'm trying to do. But I'm an engineer, not a PI. 
I've scanned all the potential sabotage areas I can think of. But I don't know who to trust anymore. Sounds like a lot went down before the Hyperion docked. Yeah, I guess. Wait! That's it! You can't possibly be involved in this. You weren't even here during the mutiny. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me. If they start hitting critical systems. Yeah, of course, dude. We'll find out who the fucking... Who sure the dark bag is. What can I do? If you could scan these other panels while I fix this one, that'd really help. I've sent the locations to your Omnitool. Just send me the data when you're done. Easy. No, 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 I, I'm fine. And I don't, I don't know, it, it just blew up. Find out why. Be careful. Oh, shit. He's one of Cash's boys, so... That's the one we're doing. You fucking stop blowing panels up. Pathfinder, to cover their tracks, the saboteur is overloading power to this panel from another junction relay. You can scan and trace the connective wiring to locate the surrogate panel. Wait, so that one's been sabotaged. Those is the hand of death. Too small for listen. You'd be surprised. There's also for vine in the seed bank. Nobody's making creeper in Andromeda. You'd be surprised. Liam, I'll talk to you in a second, dude. Trace the wiring to locate the panel that the saboteur used. Are oh, you a piece of shit? Scanning power junction relays. This panel is malfunctioning. Without more data, I cannot determine if this is a normal malfunction or sabotage. I'll just disable power to the panel until Raj can check it out. Wait, wait. Where the hell did I do that? Disembarkation procedures for Hyperion are on hold. Please await further instructions. You want me to actually poke around in there? I don't think that's a good idea. How am I supposed to find out where that wire goes? T in jail? Find you, you sneaky wire guy. Pathfinder, I received the data from Sam. It really is sabotage. Any idea as to who it might be? Yeah. All these panels were worked on by Zara. I just can't believe it. Not Zara! Security video logs confirm that Zara Kellis worked on these panels, as well as the one Raj Patil encountered. Well, shit. Any idea where she is now? Kellis is currently working on a panel on the Hyperion main deck. Oh, you're fucked. You're fucked, Zara. I'm coming for you. Can't stay up, fall asleep in my chair. Have a good stream. Catch you tomorrow at some point. Don't you go to sleep, creature. You fuck it up. Wait. I thought it was on... Wait. Wait, Zara, where are you? Wait, where's Zara? Is that not Zara there? Disembarkation procedures for Hyperion are on hold. Please await further instructions.
Confront the saboteur. Pick a use arrow. Where are you at, Zara? I'm going to confront you if I can ever fucking find you. Said you was on the upper deck, right? Oh, we got to go down. She's down a bit further, okay. She's in here. Call it, don't talk to me. Wait, wait. Wait, where are you taking me? No. Please be advised that Hyperion In front. Sabotaging, blah blah blah. I mean, I guess if it's making me go that way, let's do it. Let's friggin do it. No, not yet. We've still got a bunch of chat to do. It's already throwing a bunch of quests at us, but we're doing them all. Completed a mission. Get to know everybody. This is what we're going to do. With this crazy over here. But the planet was toxic. What if they store oxygen in porous tissue, like Quiro's rockfish? I still reckon they had breather gear stowed in that armor. Perhaps both. Life is infinitely adaptable, as our expedition proves. Oh, Harry, what you You think? must be the Pathfinder. Wonderful. You and your Sam are exactly what we need. Thanks, Mr. Professor Herrick. My colleagues and I will work with your Sam and the data you gather to solve Andromeda's scientific mysteries. Okay, you mean if I join in? I'm usually out in the field, but I wouldn't mind talking shop. Uh, lab. You know. You are always welcome. Not that we've had much to study, with everyone cooped up for 14 months. Oh, that's awesome. But your data on the Scourge flows like poetry. Now we can better advise on repairing the damage it caused. And maybe Addison will give us a real workspace. Who can think with all this racket? Engineering update. This is very true. Who can think with that? Chief Logan, I want to talk to you, Chief Logan. We can. We're not allowed to. Dr. Aran Aridana. Aridana. Pathfinder, we've had some trouble. Oh. Anything I can help with? Perhaps. I discharged an away team to get readings from a section of the Scourge that was behaving anomalously. They haven't reported in for some time, and sensors can't locate their shuttle. I sent them out there. Good, dedicated people. I fear what might have happened to them. Okay. Just have have hope. They'll make it back. Don't give up hope. He's looking when I'm out there over here. I'll see if I can find them. Their friends and family. She's will avoiding want to eye know contact. What's happened. And I I need to know. She was looking at him. Oh, we've just, we've just found out there's a bit of a little love affair going on with Aridana and this little Herrick. Ooh, she on up. She now she's eyeballing him up. You're a bit of a hussy. Okay. I'm so damn go to go to bed, Gram Grammar. Go to bed, Gramps. This is wrong. Just wrong. Ooh, strike team missions? The hell? I know that look. The others bent your ear, did they? Something like that? You get used to it. Just focus on being a pathfinder. Can't argue with results. Though they'll try. Anyway, welcome to Militia HQ. Excuse the mess. This office fields militia work, Nexus security, and looking for the Turian Ark. What's the word on the Turian Ark? Scattered readings. Some indicate the Natanus was destroyed, others that people are alive. Who knows? If you need anything, come see me, even if it's just a vent. Okay, I like this guy. I already like him. 
Are the other Turians managing okay? So-so. We're not good at sitting around in a crisis. Service before self gets drummed into us at boot camp. That's probably why so many of us are in the militia. We like to earn our citizenship, whatever galaxy we're in. But it's hard to focus with our arc missing. Who's face? This guy? The Turian? It's rough out there. I might need backup, if you can spare the people. I have strike teams specializing in assault and extraction. If you need serious firepower, my Apex teams have you covered. In fact, I could give you authority to dispatch them. It'll cut down their response time. Thank you. Our current ops are on the terminal. See if there's anything that could use a shot where it counts. Okay. That's badass that we get to actually jump into all of the militia battles that are going on. That's just how he is, dude. That's how he looks. Cool as fuck, right? It's like he's wearing a bone mask. But nope. That's just Jurians for you. You talk like you weren't part of the leadership. How did you end up commanding the militia? I was escorting a prospecting team on some moon when those Ket found us. They penned us like cattle for experiments. I managed to get loose, snatched a gun, and freed the others. By the time we killed the bastards and headed back to war in the Nexus, everyone looked at me like I was in charge. That sounds familiar. The militia grew from there. Funny, once the heat is on, all kinds of people rise to the top. Yeah. You're the cream of the crop. The riser to the top. Even though you got a weird bone face going on. What brought you out here to Andromeda? I was tired of being the good one. The good one? The Kandros family is old military. There were expectations, you know. Then my sister became a sculptor and cousin Nyrene went pirate on Omega. Everyone was proud that I stayed in service. But I kept wondering, when do I get my adventure? Jen Garson's dream was so grand, so gutsy, I had to be part of it. What do you know about the enemies we've encountered? The Ket. We yeah, he's got an exoskeleton, isn't he? Exoskeleton. don't take kindly cool. to anyone studying them. Not sure why. They don't talk to us. Every time we cross paths, there's a fight or they take prisoners. Why? What do they want? No one knows. But I've seen their weaponry and what they do to those prisoners. I want them a long, long way from the Nexus. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pat. Oh, I'm going for a duty. Do you, you want to go together? Like women? <laughs> Lieutenant! Based on the status report of 16C, it seems we're no closer gaining a foothold in any sector. Without decent recon and greater intel on the enemy, I'm starting to think our efforts are futile. The risks involved and continued loss of resources and lives make it hard to justify. With morale less low, we need to scale down expectations again. This console reports on the militia's current strike team missions, Pathfinder. Please speak with Tyrion Kandros for authorization to participate. Well, I just... I just did, and he told me to have a look at it. God damn it. Getting to know you. This is a nightmare. Do, 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 do. What's a nightmare? Are you okay? It's not right. It's not fair. What's wrong? What's wrong? Oh my, you're... So it's true. A Pathfinder has found us. There's hope at last. Maybe you could help. You're impartial. This whole thing has gotten so political. My husband, he's locked up and slated for exile for a crime he didn't commit. Oh shit, yeah, I seen him. He looks like a hamster in a cage. So, what was his crime? What exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda, but the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have. There are witnesses and evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Nilkin Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him, please. I'll go nilk him. <laughs> like milk him for information. <laughs> okay. 
Yeah, of course there's going to be team. Damn right there's team. I'd be happy to. Oh, thank you. I'm sure the jailer will allow you a visit. Please, tell Nilkin I love him. I'll say, I'll tell Nilkin I love him. I'll say, Nilkin, I love you. And he'll be like, dude, I don't even know you. And I'll just say, well, oh, sorry, I meant that the lady over there that I don't know the name of because I wasn't paying too much attention. What's your name? Okay, I'll tell him I love him instead. I'll, as long as he knows someone loves him, maybe he won't try hang himself with these shoelaces. You never know. Liam, you doing okay, buddy? Sup, bruv? Pathfinder, no time for our beer yet. This place is a mess. Security is it. Let's call it strained. I can believe it. The Nexus is running on empty. Not just that. A lot of the exiles were security. Everyone was trained and armed for Frontier. We know Ket are dangerous, and now we have to worry about our people too. No idea where they went, but they left mad. They were frustrated. If they just wanted to kill, they could have fought to the last here. Apparently we're the big hope for everyone. Not the Hyperion showing. Just us. I'm with you. It's just... a lot. As long as the Nexus is here, as long as we're here, we have a job to do. Double down crisis mode. I can do that. We can do that. Ready and willing, Pathfinder. Ready and willing, Pathfinder. You know what? The lip sync's pretty good in this. For the most part, it's, it's actually really good. Um, okay, well, I'll, I'll go talk to your, your husband in jail. The your missus sends her love. She's only over there. Like, she doesn't want to visit. I don't know why. She's, like, 20 feet away. Hey, jailer, do you mind if I... I ain't seen you're a gold digger, but you're a friggin' arms dealer. Weapons and stuff. I got you covered. Oh, it's what's going on with your shoulder? What I got. It'd be a lot easier if I weren't missing half my stock. Okay, sure thing. You got it. Shop till you drop. Here I come. That's fine. Hey, wait. Please don't drop anything you bought from me, okay? Tam would have my head if anything happened to you on my account. We can buy little guns. How much money do we have? We got a hundred credits. You got nothing for a hundred bucks? Get the fuck out of here. You're gonna sell me a vapor for eight hundred bucks, but you'll only buy main for one sixty? Dude. You realize we're trying to set up a colony bunches of them? And you're gonna go fleece me straight away. Oh, that's if you don't even want to deal with it, dude. That's pretty funny. Hey, I ain't got no time for real talk with a real face. I'm going to go order it online. Right in front of your store and I'll collect it. Help you. Pathfinder Rider, here to see Nilkin Rensis. Ah, our murderer. Wife's here all the time. Guess she told you her sob story. Milkan, you're moving up in the world. There's a Pathfinder wanting to chat with you. The Pathfinder, huh? They called in the big guns to exile Andromeda's first murderer. Your wife's all broken up over this. She says you didn't do it, and that she loves you. <sighs> She's a wonderful person. At this point, it's too late. They found me guilty. Why don't you tell me what happened? I was part of the futile effort to set up a colony on Eos. We were on our last legs, overrun by hostiles, our leader dead. The security chief, Reynolds, my friend, he refused to call for evacuation. I argued with him. Everyone saw. Yeah, big deal. I mean, arguments happen. I argue with Mel all the time, but I'm not a murderer. Yet. Last I checked, getting into a spat wasn't against the law. There's more. He ordered us to regroup and counterattack. We were moving through a sandstorm. I saw movement, thought it was the cat, and I, I guess I panicked and fired. A witness saw the chief's chest explode. Holy shit, dude, you're a murderer. Sounds like an accident. That's what I told them. 
but I was enraged when we argued. There is a recording. It's, it's ugly. Everyone's certain I did it on purpose so we could evacuate. Only my word otherwise. Don't throw in the towel yet. I'll review the evidence. Maybe I can find something that'll help. That would be great. You're a Pathfinder. I'm sure Kandros would give you access. Maybe there's still hope. Damn right, dude. Damn right. I don't think he'd done it. I think it was genuinely how he said. Although he's quite happy to coin himself as the murderer of Andromeda, right? So, I don't know. I don't know. Get into know the Nexus.